Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog featuring my R32 GTR. You can be my guiding light. Keep me company in the night. It's all I need. All I want. So I've always wanted a Skyline ever since I was young. Me and my brother used to play Gran Turismo, and the R32 GTR used to be our dream car. It's everybody's dream car. Come on. to trust anyone online or overseas to buy a car for you and send it over to you so thank god i watch your car bro i think he's working with garage defense which is a huge company over in mainland japan i ended up sliding into his dms on instagram and spencer was actually able to hook me up with garage defense and he was basically the middleman made me contact the owner whose name is dawson he sent me pictures of the car, told me everything about the car, anything you need, even videos of the car, they, were, they sent to me. Uh, to start the transactions, you have to be able to pay the car full, or if you don't pay it in full, they can garage the car for you, but you also have to pay for storage. By storage, I mean you could do payments on the car until it's paid off in full, but you also have to pay it for storage. I'm pretty sure it's not that expensive for storage. And then once it's paid in full, they'll be able to send it over. So I basically got a 91 Skyline GTR. As you can see, it's very clean. No rust whatsoever. Has about 94,000 kilometers. Yep, 94,287. That's about 50 something thousand miles. It's completely stock. All it has is the Momo steering wheel, those aftermarket uh, floor mats, and I believe this is an N1 front bumper. It's not the stock one. And that's about it. Everything else is completely stock, as you can see. Shout out to JDM Surikawa. I got this from them. If you guys want to cop one, just go on Instagram, JDM Surikawa, or on the internet. I'm going to pop the hood for you guys so you guys can see. Also, I like that they, um, this is not stock either. So you guys know this. And what is that, Carrizo? And I also got this from a guy on Facebook. Because uh, if you guys know that. There's no cup holders in GTRs, all the early ones. Okay. Go pop the hood. There she is, the old RB26, the heart of the beast. Everything in there is completely stock. Just actually work which is amazing it's all stock all right guys so basically the wait for the car it took a while i paid the car in march and i just received the car like less than a week ago and we're in july now you have to deal with the import dawson brings the car to the port in japan they have to get a schedule with the port because the port can't just take the car the same day they have to have like a certain amount of cars before they can bring everything over at once. Once the car leaves port in Japan, that's it. Dustin has done his job. He gave me a phone number of Daniel, who's in New York, and that's where I'm at right now. And he was able to, you know, when the car was getting here, and because he was the one that was able to go into the port and do all the paperwork for me, translate all the paperwork, and he actually sent me all the paperwork before I got the car. You have to deal with somebody towing your car, basically, because I wasn't able to go like five, six hours away to pick it up, so I had to have someone, and that's another payment you have to make. So when they ship your car, that's another payment you have to make too, just so you guys know. You guys, share, like, and subscribe. I'm gonna be doing things to this car. It's probably not gonna keep it stock. 
So if you guys want to know what's going to happen to it, just subscribe and follow me. If you have any questions about the process or anything, comment down below. Follow me on Instagram, I'll have all the links below for everything.